Hello everyone, an update here on the CAR52 video from yesterday. First, we have this new amazing footage which is enhanced, zoomed in and slowed down, allowing us to see the incident in amazing detail. So we can see that a large missile approached from above the CAR52. Right at impact, we see a large chunk of the helicopter go flying off to the right as well as many smaller pieces. And we also see the helicopter pop some flares, a little bit late there Chuck. The rotors spin for a second or so before failing and the helicopter just drops like a brick. It's pretty cool footage, so much clearer than the ones which we saw yesterday. Now before we look at the video and some screenshots some more, I just want to make a correction. I initially thought the report that it was Nipro air defences and that meant air defences around Nipro. Instead, it is a unit based out of Nipro. The unit is the 138th Anti-Aircraft Missile Brigade. Back to the video and this screenshot here. As you can see, the missile is large and approaches the helicopter from above and at a steep angle. Given the size of the missile, we can rule out some suggestions which have been made. Mampad, Javelin and even Excalibur have been suggested. But as we can see with this screenshot, it isn't one of those. This could be a book, but the most likely candidate is this being an S300. OSINT Technical on Twitter suggests the 5V55 from the S300. The angle is a bit sharp than is usually typical for the S300, but a few comments have suggested that the S300 was reaching the but a few comments have suggested that the S300 was reaching the end of its range when it impacted the helicopter. Five V55 variants have ranges from between 47 kilometers, 90 kilometers, or up to 150 kilometers, depending on which variant of the 5V55 it is. Now this screenshot, something interesting. I don't think it's relevant to the shoot now, but at the bottom right, uh, but at the bottom right, you can see a white drone bobbing around near the bottom of the screen near the trees. Whose it is is impossible to tell, but it's here before the impact, so it isn't debris. The second update is this, translated from a Russian telegram page. So as you can see here, this crew were considered to be the best of the CAR-52 pilots, picking up six orders of courage, which is a prestigious Russian medal. The translation says they've been awarded Golden Hero Stars, which is the hero of the Russian Federation, the highest honour that Russia gives. So in this case, the crew were a bigger loss than the airframe itself. So that's it for this video. I thought it worth taking a look at the update because of the new, very impressive, very clear footage, which offers a bit of insight as to what hit the car 52, and also the information about the crew. If you found the video interesting, please click like and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. Thanks again, and take care everyone.